good morning. I'm back in the office again and um, see how we do. Well, good morning. Well, no, good afternoon. It's uh, the 20th of April at the moment and I am back in sunny London, as you can see. Uh, it's a beautiful day. It's really nice to actually get some sun back in the city and it's been a busy day. So as I saw this morning, I probably showed you my commute. I was planning on doing a little video as soon as I got into the office and usually I'm the first one in the office uh, at 8 a.m. But today I wasn't, so I couldn't. But here we are. I just wanted to give you more of an update of what's going on in my life at the moment. What's returning to work like and uh, shit that I need to get done. Yeah, I'm currently on my lunch break at the moment, so I'm just kind of wandering around and taking in at some of the views, enjoying a bit of time. I've popped into a local church because I quite like spending a bit of time there. Yeah, that's about it really. This church. It's really, really nice. It's a really, really nice church. All right, catch you in a bit. trying to figure out a way to get back into the YouTube game because I appreciate I've been away for a little while and this is my first upload in what eight months or something I think I may have found a solution is the baby hello 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 See, the problem is I just don't have enough time with all these additional responsibilities, including, you know, raising a family and having to commute back into London. But what I realized is I don't necessarily need to be setting up a studio and planning out all of these videos all of the time. Because of the way that technology is now, I have a 4K video in my pocket at all times. And that just opens a world of possibilities in terms of being able to record new videos and bring content to you guys on a more regular basis. Now, I can't promise it's gonna be coffee content all of the time. It's gonna be a mixture of things and I'm gonna fit it around me. So if I'm in the office, I might be able to catch some stuff on the way into work when I'm on break, what I'm doing, but you might get a bit more of an idea of my life now and how it's fundamentally changed and how it fundamentally changes once you have children. But overall, I sort of want to come back to this idea that YouTube isn't about the glitz and glamour. It isn't about having to use the most expensive equipment and having to record the most pristine looking video possible. It's about pulling out your mobile phone, being able to record yourself using your selfie camera because that's 4K now for whatever reason, and just upload a video. You know, when I used to start watching YouTube in whatever, 2007, it was very amateur. Something about that which was quite nice. It was something for creators, people that wanted to express themselves and show off their interests and things like that. Now, personally, I've got a myriad of different interests and stuff that I really want to share uh, and just sort of express a piece of myself online. So, plan is, more regular content, won't necessarily be coffee, will be a mixture of things, and will be more regular, but it won't necessarily be the quality that you expect. So certain aspects of my videos are going to be a bit more run and gun. A bit like this when I'm trying to cook or I'm trying to do something else. Because realistically, I don't have time to get my full studio set up together. So a lot of the time, it's going to be using my mobile phone. And because of the way technology is now, it's much, much, much easier to be able to do that. I think it was a Dan Mace video or maybe a Casey video or something that I saw recently that said, think less, create more. And that really hit home to me. Because the problem I've been struggling with is not having the time to be able to script properly, to be able to research properly, and bring you guys the content that I initially did. It became a lot more difficult and a little overwhelming. So the plan is to become more comfortable on camera and to bring you guys more regular content, which isn't necessarily so scripted, blah, blah, blah. One of my big passions in life is cinema, and I'd really like to become a much, much better cinematographer and be able to shoot that kind of really cool content too. But at the same time, I think there's an important balance to be had 
when it comes to something like YouTube, that we don't forget the roots, where it came from, and that not everything needs to be super, super polished all of the time. A lot of it can just be filmed on a mobile phone, talking directly to your audience, and that's exactly what I want to do. So, if you think you're going to be interested in this kind of content going forward, please drop me a subscribe, hit that like button, smash it if you want, and I promise to be uploading a lot, lot more regular content. Just to prove my point, I couldn't be bothered to go get the tripod because I didn't want to wake the kid up, so I made this out of a bunch of history books and self-help books that I had stacked in the bookshelf behind me. Create more, think less. Hello, darling. I'm sorry that we don't necessarily spend as much time with you anymore as we do with the baby, but don't forget you are still loved.